All right, guys, today is day one of the build of the fire pit. So these are just some of the rocks that we went around and collected around our homestead. Let me give you guys an idea. All right. And they don't all have to be the same. They don't, no. You're never gonna find a rock exactly. Each rock is a character of itself. There's some of the small ones we picked up. <coughs> and here's where we got our bag of mortar mix to get everything put together. You'll see me mix that. And we're kind of just getting the layout of all the big rocks first, and then we'll build the small rocks, set those into the mortar mix, and then we've ran around and grabbed all the flat rocks like this that we're gonna clean up. And those will be the caps for the top of the fire pit. So you're probably all wondering, what are we gonna do about ventilation for the fire pit? Well, see where the hole is right there? There's a bunch of holes underneath there. We're gonna leave those open so that the air can get to it and keep the fire going. So we're gonna start building. Me and Junior all the way. I got Junior clearing off a rock here of all the dirt and stuff. Now we are putting the rocks and some water just to clean them up. As you can see right here, I reach down and grab one. This just cleans them up for us. Every rock's got some care to see. Still got some mud on it. So I'll rub my hand around it real quick. See all that? Another rock we got there. And a big one. And we'll clean them up real good. We get a I'm gonna get a little bit of a brush and we're gonna have him uh, go around and brush them all. Rinse them in the water so we can get them cleaned up. And you gotta clean them up so you get the character. You can see the color variations in them and stuff like this one right here. If you look at that one, you can see. It's beginning of the fire pit. And you're watching it here on the Swisher Homestead. So don't forget to hit the subscribe, the like button, and the share button. Tell your friends about it. Hope you all enjoy this. This is something I haven't seen done yet by anybody really. So, hopefully, we'll be, doubt it, that we're one of the first, but you get to see it here on our channel. So at that point, me and Junior are going to work. We'll see you in a few. All right, guys, so this is what we're doing right now. Kind of give you an idea. We've got the top stack on the, the fire pit, all the flat parts of rock that we can find. Now what we do is once you get it mortared in, let it sit for a few minutes, throw some water on it, and it'll wash all the over of the, the mortar mix you put in there. Then what Desmond's doing is Desmond's taking a paint stir that we cut in like this, Let's cut like this. And what he's doing is he's packing in the, the mortar mix into the rock like this. So just took a paint stick, kind of like tongue depressor. If you can get a hold of some tongue depressors, they work great. We just cut a little bit of a rounded edge so we got something to work with. And then we'll go down like this and we'll pack it all in. That seals it up real good. That's what we're doing. So what do you think? I'm gonna take a little bit of water, 
wash that down wipe around the rock where we don't want to stick too much and don't worry about the outer edge all this little stuff because what we'll, what I'll have him do is take it I'm trying to hold this with my hand and not get concrete or not get the camera wet so just bear with me for a second here all right so what we'll do is we'll take the leftovers that fell off and we'll just pack it in just like that and we'll do that all the way around now we left gaps holes so that it can get air for the fire because the one thing you need is oxygen and without oxygen you have no fire so we got the tops all basted in now did the interior I'm gonna go around and clear all this up Desmond's done all that. He's packing that stuff in real good. We're going around and we're doing it to it. That's a fire pit from scratch. All the stuff off the homestead. All of Mother Nature's greatness in its best. And we'll get back to you and show you some more here in a sec.